for the game show. of the Insanely Awesome Quiz Show. Today, we have two very special guests, one that you've seen before and one that you haven't. The one that you've seen before is wearing something on his head. The one that you haven't seen before is also wearing something on his head, and I, of course, am not wearing anything on my head. So, introduce yourself for the people. Uh, I'm Liam. Hi. I'm Jordan. Now, Jordan has been here before because he is my progeny. This one right here, who's taller than me, has not been here before, and he's definitely not my progeny. Although, I would be ashamed if he was. So, thank you for coming today. Thank you for coming today. All right. Uh, good luck today. I think that we may actually get some points today because he looks smart. That one is not smart, but sometimes on a Sunday when he's sleeping, he definitely looks smart. So we may have something going for him. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah? All right. So are you guys ready to get started? You ready out there? You guys ready? Yeah. All right. Let's go. All right. Question number one. What is the middle name of the United States number two goalkeeper? Now, He's going to think that Tim Howard is the number one goalkeeper, and at this moment, Brad Guzan is the number two goalkeeper. Is that correct? Or has Tim Howard, at this moment, on March 11th, May 11th, 2017, been demoted to off the team, and Brad Guzan is the number one goalkeeper? And so, who would be the number two goalkeeper? I said all that to confuse them, because I'm me. Three seconds. Okay. Now, before you answer, I forgot to do this because I have memory problems, which have aided me in losing my car at the airport seven distinct times. Which one of you will be the, did we ever figure out a word? Comment below if you remember we ever figured out a word for this. Oh, the person. answerer person, spokesperson. spokesperson, it's not a spokesperson, you're not selling anything. That the the lead. But you're speaking guy. for the other people. Oh, poor baby. Who's gonna be the lead? You're gonna be the lead. Okay. So now you have your answer. Yeah. All right. Liam is going to answer for the team. What is your answer? There is no number two goalkeeper. That is the dumbest answer <laughs> I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> On every soccer team, there is a number two goalkeeper. So <laughs> that is a definite. <laughs> wow. Okay, that was bad. Wait, okay. what's the answer? So, moving on. What's Question answer? number two. Wait, so if you don't know the don't answer, know the then answer. how do you know they got, why could they just Question say a random name? number two. Are you ready for question number two? Yeah. Should we move on or should we... Wait, did on? you tell them that they can challenge one? Why is my cameraman <laughs> speaking to me? Why is he speaking to me? <laughs> cameraman, stop talking. Thank you very much. Stop shaking the camera. All right, put your hand there. All right, question number two. What is the percentage of star left-footed players in the midfield for every team ever? Mm. Now, not every, not every. A player, but every star. Three seconds. I, I, uh, we say four percent. Four percent is actually a horrible answer because we're talking about star and not um, regular players. But the correct answer is zero. So. I why is it zero? Because stars are in the night sky and not on the football pitch. All right. This has been going very well so far. But we're going to take a little time out for a commercial break and learn about Liam Perella. <laughs> Just a little bit. So, Liam, I've known you for a few years now, and I know a lot about you. Mm -hmm. But they don't know. Tell us one thing 
that the world does not know that you would like the world to know about you and only you. And it cannot be about your girlfriend. I play soccer. <laughs> He's the worst guest ever. <laughs> so let's move on. Jordan, could you tell us one thing you want the world to know about you that it doesn't already? Well, that says it all. That's my son. <laughs> he definitely has it all together. So we will move on to the game show. Baftisto. What? Forget, forget that part. I got no Baftisto? No, it's not a word. I was going to say after these messages, but we're already back after the messages. So it doesn't Are we having another sense. commercial break? No, no, no. That's what is, what is one thing you want the world to know about you? One thing that I would like the world to know about me is that I enjoy quiz shows, and it's now question number three. Question number three. How many eyes? Five seconds. Oh, we're question. <laughs> Two. Would you like me to repeat the question? There was no question. Yeah. Would you like me to repeat the yeah, question? That was I, a statement. We, yeah, that was a statement. That was not a question. There was no, uh, there was the subject, no <laughs> verb. <laughs> Would you like me to repeat the question? Yeah. How many eyes? <clears throat> I think I have the answer. I will repeat the question for the camera. <laughs> How many eyes? <laughs> now, at this moment, I will allow them to use a lifeline. We have created lifelines after <laughs> show number four, but they're only allowed to be used at my discretion. And right now, I will allow you to use a lifeline. So, now, uh, how would let me tell you what the lifelines are? Okay, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Lifeline number one is phone a friend. Oh, I know who to call. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Lifeline number two is Google. Pay me, YouTube. Because, you know, Indoors Google means. owns YouTube. Yeah, okay, thank you. And lifeline number three is smell a dog's butt. <laughs> All right. So, uh, you can use one of those lifelines. Should we call Blake? What? Talk to each other. All right. We're going to phone a friend. They're going to phone a friend. All right. So, we will give you two minutes, two minutes to phone a friend. Uh, if someone doesn't answer, then your lifeline is used. And you must put them on speaker. It must be on speaker. So, your lifeline has been used up. And you know what that means. That's the end of our show. They do what? not get an answer. Thank you for joining us on the... I object. <laughs> You're not allowed to object, so put your hand down. What about the but challenge? In the, in the rules? You, that that was, was the challenge. No, if they don't answer... That's not a challenge. Not, that's you got to oh, challenge. Oh, the challenge. challenge. I challenge. Oh, the challenge is also at my discretion. Yeah, you, you, never you never said that. Yeah, you never so said that. So thank you for joining us in the on the video. insanely awesome quiz show. <laughs> I'm your host, PJ Liddell. I'll see you next time. Like the video. Comment. Comment. I subscribe to the channel, so you should too. If you want good food, subscribe! You heard them people. Like, comment, subscribe!